Middle Georgia Pride, Milledgeville. There's a place to go that sets the standard for free access to technology in Milledgeville. It's called Digital Bridges. It's a project Milledgeville residents started that aims to improve the quality of life for people living in that community. 41 NBC's Rashad Hollis has more. Digital Bridges has been open for 18 months, and during a time when companies were laying off and people were looking for jobs, Digital Bridges stepped in and looked for ways to help the Milledgeville community. In the beginning, it was extremely technology focused. However, as we turned it over to the community and really started surveying and, and holding public hearings and things, we quickly discovered that the economy was the greatest concern for this community. So the company came up with a plan. The focus shifted from just looking for innovative uses of technology as it applies to the community and instead looking for how we can prepare people for the job market that's changing. And with a changing job market, there was a need to help people get back to work. In this day and age, it is more important than ever to be able to use the internet and computer resources, especially for job hunting, uh, finding out information and doing research on different things, especially for the students with the research and some of the people that have been laid off from their jobs that need to fill out online applications now. Everything is pretty much centered around technology. Digital Bridges has state-of-the-art computers and flip cameras that small businesses can use to make their own commercials on YouTube. Yeah, I very nice. Light decoration and uh, assistant here, very friendly. We can't just depend anymore on people that can drive to your store. You also have to have a great online presence. And so we do a lot to teach people and prepare them for how other people are kind of um, interchanging information. Everybody is different, that's for sure. Everybody has a different kind of background that they're drawing from when it comes to computers. Some of them are scared to death to even touch them. Some of them have had some limited experience. So we kind of have to identify it on an individual level about what their needs are, where we need to start them from, and what kind of type of concepts we really need to drive home at first. In Milledgeville, Rashad Hollis, 41 NBC News. Digital Bridges is free for anyone to use within the Baldwin County community. If you'd like more information, you can call 387-0254.